Drive wheel braking skids occur when the rear drive wheels lock. Locked wheels have less traction than rolling wheels, and this will cause the tractor to slide sideways. When pulling a trailer, this will also cause the trailer to push the tractor sideways and cause a tractor jackknife. If your tractor begins to jackknife, stop braking so that your drive wheels can roll freely and stop skidding. Additionally, when driving a vehicle with a manual transmission and roads are slick, push the clutch in to allow the wheels to roll freely. As the tractor turns back on course, you will need to counter steer to stop it from continuing to turn too far and skidding in the other direction. Trailer skids occur most often during hard braking events or when poor road conditions cause the trailer to lose traction. When this happens, the trailer will tend to swing out from behind the tractor. This is called a trailer jackknife. If your trailer begins to jackknife, the earlier you notice it, the better your chances are for correcting it. You can check to see if your trailer is jackknifing by checking your mirrors. If you see the trailer starting to swing out of your lane, let off the brakes and if possible, apply light throttle. This will allow the tractor to pull the trailer back into your lane and stop jackknifing. The best way to prevent either type of jackknifing is to brake earlier and lighter and adjust your speed based on road conditions.